What's up, ballers? We are back with some more NBA Live Mobile, and we have got a crazy video for you guys today. Look at this 98 Rudy Gobert. So starting out, he was only a 92. If you train him up, he only goes up to a 97, but the amount of boost that we've got on this card is ridiculous. 98 paint shot, 102 dunk rating, one, oh no, not quite. Ooh, do I want to switch it up? We could go 98 block rating and 102 dunk rating, or if I switch out Steve Kerr for, I believe, there's a defensive coach. I think Rick Carlisle, I think he gives, yeah, a boost to shot block. So if I switch out Tim Hardaway and throw in a defensive player, we get plus two to shot block. Then we end up with two 100 stats, 100 dunking and 100 block. I think we're gonna go with that because that definitely sounds cooler than 102 and 98, just in my opinion. But this dude is a monster. 80, like he's a center and he's got 88 dribbling. He's gonna be going straight to the basket on every single play, 95 on ball defense. Oh my gosh, this dude's gonna be unstoppable. We're gonna hop into some gameplay. I think I had the best possible boost for him, at least for the stats that I had. I tried like every possible combination of players that I had and couldn't quite get him up to a 99. Let me know if there's any players I should pick up. I know Victor Oladipo is one player that gives more of a boost than some of the players that I have, but these New Year's players give ridiculous boosts, so I'm definitely happy with what I've got for right now. Like I said, we are going to hop into some gameplay and see what the dude can do. Before we get started, we do have our notification squad shoutouts for the first six people to comment on our last video, so I'm going to put those up there. If you want a shot at being in one of those, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below and turn on notifications so you know as soon as I upload and can be one of the first people to comment. Getting started, he's going to be going up against 89 Carl Anthony Towns. That is what I like to call barbecue chicken. So we're going to win this jump ball. I've done some gameplay with him already and the dude literally does not miss. He just dunks it every single time as you can see right there. So starting off, Shooting 100% from the field. I'm going to see if, like in this entire gameplay, we cannot miss a single shot. We're going to throw it back up to him. Going in again. Can't be blocked. That's what 102 dunk rating will do for you. The dude... Okay, there are times where I say in my videos, this dude is unstoppable. Rudy Gobert is actually unstoppable. When you've got an 88 uh, dribble rating and you've got 102 dunk rate. Oh, okay. Okay, he is stoppable. That still doesn't really make any sense because he's got a 88 dribble rating and that dude had a 71 steal rating. But I'll give him credit where credit's due. That wasn't a terribly... Okay. Okay, let's see, Rudy. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. I'm not really sure how he got a dunk blocked with 102 dunk rating, but we're going to keep playing through. I was going to... I was thinking, oh, should I restart the gameplay? But he's still got six points in the first, what, 25 seconds? And he's got that 100 block rating. You will not stop this man. And he's got the handles. Going in. Dunking the ball again. So he's not absolutely unstoppable, but he's pretty dang close to being unstoppable. Absolutely ridiculous. Get you a center that can do both. Get you a center that can dribble the ball and dunk on everybody on the court. Come on, Rudy. I need you to not get the ball stolen. Whoop, that was dangerous. All right, and he's going to get that easy. Goaltending. There we go. Easy call right there. 10 points already. Really, I just need to fix my defense. We'd be doing so much better if I was actually playing smart defense. If I would use the switch button more, I would get so many more steals and allow so, <laughs> so many fewer points. Let's see. All right, and our guys are just kind of standing there because Allen Iverson doesn't want to give me any steals. That was absolutely terrible defense, and it is tie game because Bobby Buckets does not know how to play defense in this game. I have attempted one jump shot with him, so that's not something I would recommend. The only jump shot I attempted, he was pretty open and he straight up bricked it. You don't really need to attempt jump shots because anytime he touches the ball inside, it's already game over. Whoa, Ben Simmons, stay on your man. All right, all right, Iverson, lock him down. Oh, that's cookies. That's cookies! Woo, Iverson, I need that. That's gonna be a miss. Oh my gosh, Tim Hardaway maxed out is a monster. I wanna go for the buzzer beater with Ben Simmons. But this is Rudy Gobert gameplay. All we do is dunk on people. All we do is dunk on people. 14 points. I think if I play like halfway decent defense next game, we can probably do a lot better. So I'm going to try to focus a little bit more on that. Oh my gosh. 
98 Rudy Gobert versus out of position Isaiah Thomas. This is going to be so much fun. We're playing 100% bully ball right now. 100% like give it straight to him. Give it. Nope. 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 Oh my gosh. Of course he gets the steal. Oh, Bobby, you got to get it to him at the top of the key. Otherwise that's going to happen. <laughs> oh, the one time I get a mismatch and I completely blow it. Come on. Allen Iverson. That's going to be a steal. That's a miss though. I'm sorry. Double teamed? Double team, sir! Sir, bully ball. What? How are you gonna... There we go. Okay, that makes a little bit more sense. He should be jumping over Isaiah Thomas on every single play. All right, locked out. Whoa, whoa. Okay, and... Oh, Iverson with the block! Oh, Rudy, go to the basket. Rudy, go to the basket. Up. Oh. Okay, Rudy picks the ball up. And he dunks on everybody again. He's literally like twice Isaiah Thomas's height. What do people expect is going to happen? That is one reason not to have Isaiah Thomas out of position in. That is, that's 100% bully ball. And somehow, he doesn't get the rebound right there. Like, for real? For real, Andrew Wiggins getting the boards down low. It's all right. We're just going to, we're going to show off these handles. All right. Rather than just spamming the dribble button and running at the basket. Oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh, that's not even fair. When you've got a center that can cross people up and is 7'2", and is has he has a 100 dunk and block rating. That's got to be a miss. I, okay, how can he not rebound? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Maybe he doesn't have great rebounding stats. I'm a little bit surprised that this is happening right now. Oh my gosh. Whoa, foul, sir. Foul, sir. All right, we're going to get it back into him, and then we're going to get the layup to go nice and easy. All right, this one's a little bit rougher. We're uh, we're having some glitches in gameplay that are making it a little bit tougher for me to get buckets. But we'll step it up. Oh, yes. Iverson. And where's Rudy? Rudy! Oh, that's not Rudy. Come on, Bobby. Work on your passes. Oh, he's open. Okay, not open inside, but he can hit jump shots too. Dude is unstoppable. Do not put Isaiah Thomas on this man. I'm just warning you guys, don't put Isaiah Thomas, especially now that this guy's in the game. They still cannot miss. So that was pretty well defended, in my opinion. Rudy Gobert going, oh, what? Okay, guys, I just wanted to take a second to talk about how glitchy this play was. Not because I'm mad, but because it's so funny. So if you look at the first frame, this is the frame before Rudy Gobert gets blocked. Isaiah Thomas's head is underneath Rudy Gobert's armpit. In the next frame, the ball is flying backwards, and Isaiah Thomas is still like a foot below Rudy Gobert. So obviously, this is just like a straight-up glitch in the game. There's no way he could have even touched the ball, let alone actually block his shot. So just wanted to get that out of the way before I get comments about how that was bad shot selection, because that was a straight-up glitch play. All right, final matchup. We're going up against another Isaiah Thomas. Maybe we can not get blocked this time. That would be great. I probably need to use, utilize his dribble moves a little bit more because most of the time I just spam the dribble button while going to the basket, which, while it is effective at times, oh my gosh, that's what happens when you use the dribble button right, especially when you've got a center that has 90 or uh, 88 dribbling. That should be like, come on! Y'all killing me with these shots. It looks like it's almost going back to what it was before with the difficulty of the... Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Absolute blow by on Isaiah Thomas just off of one spin move. That's almost too easy. Give me a little bit of a challenge here. All right, Ben Simmons. How is this not a steal? All right, there we go. 99 block rate. Y'all kidding me right now. It definitely told me he had 100 block rating when I went to switch him in. All right, that's, that's a little bit questionable. Time to sauce up. Sauce! Sauce! Oh! Ooh, we almost made it in. All right, here we go. And he's got a little... He's got the hook shot. Oh, that's questionable. That's questionable. All right, we're just going to let him dunk on everybody. That's just my go-to. If he's if he's not going to use his dribble moves, then just oh, jump over everybody and dunk on him. All right, Ben Simmons. I just need like... Oh, I jumped a little bit too late. Dang it. That is the one benefit of that 90 overall Isaiah Thomas out of position card. Oh, my... Oh, I shot a jump. He makes his jump shots, though. Dude is crazy good, guys. Pick him up if you haven't already. He is the best center that you will find on the auction house right now. And apparently the other team is absolutely unstoppable. Rudy going in again. Obviously, oh, Isaiah Thomas. I'm so sorry I had to do this to you. 
I'm so sorry that I had to cross you with Rudy freaking Gobert. This just makes me think of the time when he got crossed like five times in one play by, who was it, Steph Curry? And of course, I get the block and they still pick up the basketball! Okay, sorry about that. My phone died and I didn't even know my battery was low, but we still got the same score going in. Trying to see if I can get like one steal before this game is over. We haven't been doing too well on the defensive end. Ooh, we're so close! Ben Simmons so close to taking that away. Honestly, I just need to switch to Rudy Gobert down low and see how many more blocks I can get. Come on, Rudy. Oh, if he would have... Oh, if Isaiah Thomas would have shot that, that would have been in the stands. Absolutely in the stands. Cross this man. If I get blocked by Isaiah Thomas again... Okay, there we go. He's going to hit that pretty much every time. Most of the time, Isaiah Thomas is not going to manage to block him, but that one time, he somehow was able to work a miracle and block the ball with the air. And we still can't get boards. Oh, there we go. Oh, up to Rudy. Rudy! Oh, Rudy's about to pull a three. Rudy pulling a three. Oh, I thought he was going to hit it. Oh, that would have been a crazy finish to the video. So as you guys can see, he's a monster on offense. I'm just really, really bad at defense. So I'm going to work on that in the future. Honestly, I really just need to let the computer autoplay defense. I would allow a lot. There would be a lot less points scored. But it'd also probably be a lot less entertaining. So let me know in the comments if you guys want me to just like autoplay the defensive possessions. I think it's still good to see like how somebody actually plays with him rather than how the computer plays with him. But make sure to drop a like down below if you guys enjoyed. Let me know if you want to see gameplay for any of the other 92s and hit the subscribe button if you're new. And I'll see you guys next time.